Hi everyone, we are super, super excited to uh, welcome you guys to Chatham Hall and give you guys a tour. So we are standing right in front of Prudent, which is our main building. On our main building, we have our well, two floors of dorms up above, and our administrative offices to the side. So let me give you guys a tour. So we are here in the well, which is quite literally built upon the well. Here in the well, we meet and start off our week as a school body during assembly, and we have this really big meeting where everybody gets to share cool announcements like club activities, uh, birthdays that are going on, and even college announcements, which is very exciting for the seniors. And speaking about the seniors, here in the well, we have something really special called the Senior Stairs, which are over there. And the Senior Stairs are a really exciting tradition. So as you move up, you kind of move up the the chain and you get to sit on the senior stairs once you're a senior and also use the senior stairs and give the ability for other kids or other girls <laughs> to use the stairs as well. And it's a very fun tradition. It's very meaningful as well to the seniors and also the rising juniors who are going to be seniors soon. So here near the administrative offices, we have what we call the ABC board. So the ABC board is basically when your friends or your teachers can't really find you around campus or don't have the time maybe to look for you, they can hang it up here according to the first letter of your last name and you can come and pick it up anytime you pass by the ABC board, whether that be a cute note or a teacher uh, graded one of your papers and she put it up here so you can pick it up. So on this end of Prudent, we have administrative offices as well as Rector Cannell's office. Hi, Rector Cannell. Hello. So we are on our first floor of dorms, which is right above the well, which we were just at. And this is second prudent, and right above us is third prudent. And as a first year, you come in and you take a survey, and the enrollment office fills you in and connects you with a perfect roommate or someone who's just like you. And then as you move on to your second, third, and fourth year, you get to choose your own roommate, and you can maybe live with your best friend. So we are currently in the lower arcade, which connects two of our buildings, Prudent and Dabney. And every Wednesday here, uh, they bring out a tray of cookies, and you can come and pick up a cookie, which we call Cookie Break, and any drink that is available. And you go up to your advisor, have a meeting, and she kind of takes care of you throughout the year, so you get to have a conversation with her and talk with her, as well as the other people in your advisory. And as we go, I would like to introduce you guys to my friend Chaney, who is going to give you guys a tour about the classrooms. We are now in the main level of Dabney where we hold most of our mathematics and humanities classes. One unique feature about these classrooms is that the humanities classes are set up around mahogany circle tables to cultivate discussion, whereas our mathematics classrooms look a little something like this. Hi, Chaney. We are now in Dr. Daniels' classroom. Dr. Daniels is the Director of Academic Support here at Chatham Hall. She spearheads the CAMS program. In this program, you can meet individually with her to work on a specific class or study skills, or she also holds workshops and group sessions to work on more general ideas. Another program we have here is our peer tutor program. Students can sign up to tutor their friends in subjects that they love. This is the bookstore, located on the lower level of Daphne. In addition to this section of the bookstore, we also have a food and beverage section where students can buy snacks and drinks any time of the day. The lower level of Dabney is a student hub here. We have a niche area where students can hang out on the comfy couches during their free periods or in the afternoon. We also have our own movie theater. In addition, there's an exercise and fitness room that students can use in the mornings, afternoons, or weekends. Each student also has their own individualized mailbox here on the lower level of Dabney. We are now in the library, one of my favorite places on campus. One of the coolest features here in the library is that you can write on any of these glass panes or the colorful walls. Another cool feature is that you can arrange the furniture to be the collaborative space that you need. Downstairs in the lower level of the library, we have the tea room. This room is designed to be a quiet study space. Many students like to come here during study hall, which is from 8.30 to 10.30 on every weeknight. Although Chatham Hall has an Episcopal heritage, we honor and welcome girls of all backgrounds and faiths. We have three chapels a week. Some of those chapels will be senior chapel talks. A senior chapel talk is something you give before you graduate here. Girls can design the whole chapel from the hymns to their speech to having friends come sing and dance as they celebrate their time at Chatham Hall. Here at Chatham Hall, we offer many languages, Latin, French, 
Chinese, and Spanish. If a student wishes to take a different language, they can apply for a discovery challenge and pursue that interest. One fun thing we do is our language trips. We have trips to Spain and France alternating every year. These trips are three weeks long and involve studying culture as well as taking some language classes. Some other trips are our service spring break trips. These go to South Africa, India, and Finland. You can also apply for a travel grant through our iQuest and Hallam Hurt programs. I did an iQuest my junior year during spring break where I went to Italy to study how diet and culture affect the health of the Italian community. It was one of the most life-changing experiences and I'm so grateful that Chatham Hall had this opportunity. Here at Chatham Hall, we are a 24-hour community. That means that 90% of our faculty live on campus and about 95% of our students are boarders. Our beautiful campus allows us to host many weekend activities and fun traditions, such as the New Girl Purple and Gold Picnic that happens at the beginning of each year. One of the most amazing things about Chatham Hall is all the opportunities we have to be creative. For example, we're standing here in our maker space where we have 3D printers and other amazing technologies as well as our robotics lab. We also have teams that competes every year. This past year, the 910 team was ranked number one nationally for their engineering challenge. Our makerspace is located in our Shaw Science Building, where we have our physics, biology, and chemistry classes. Here's Mr. Waters, a computer science teacher and robotics mentor. Hey, Jenny. During my time here at Chatham Hall, the athletics program truly meant a lot to me. I played a varsity sport every season, and I can say that my teammates became like sisters. Here's Molly to tell you more. Basketball is an amazing opportunity for our community to come together and show school spirit. If you are looking for a new sport to play or looking to continue one that you have played in the past, Chatham Hall offers many opportunities to do so. This is the Creative Arts Building and I am in the Fine Arts Room where I took ceramics last year and enjoyed it thoroughly. To my left is the Black Box Theater where our plays are performed each year. And to my right is the Dance Studio. The dance program at Chatham Hall is an amazing way for girls to express themselves. One of our amazing things at Chatham Hall is our riding stables. The stalls can hold up to 40 horses. There's an indoor riding arena and we also have an IEA team. You can take private lessons during your free periods as well. This is our dining hall, and we have many different types of food selections such as vegetarian, vegan, and gluten-free. My favorite is the soup and salad bar. This is my advisory table where I sit every Monday and Wednesday. On Thursdays, we use these tables as rotational tables where we get to sit with someone new. Next to the dining hall, we have Dutch, our multi-purpose space. We use this space for dance, yoga, and to welcome our leader in residence, one of our signature programs. This is the Healthcare Center, also known as the HCC. It is open 24-7 and all meds are kept here. There is also complimentary counseling offered by Ms. Grosscraver. And that brings us back to the well. Thank you so much for joining us on this tour and I hope to see you soon on campus.